Hi everyone, welcome to this stream. Oh my god, it's been so long since I did this last time. I'm just like so lost, but <laughs> I think it's gonna be okay. It's just um, a bit of a weird thing to do after like a couple of weeks, isn't it? But I'm just gonna be prepping some things to like make my job a little bit easier here. There we go. I think that's Okay, I'm good. I'm good. So hi, welcome to the stream. I was honestly getting a little bit worried because, um, you know, the eclipse and everything today, I really thought that people wouldn't be showing up. So I was just like, oh, I'll, I'll have to treat this as like just making a video. <laughs> um, but I'm glad that at least you're here now. So that's that's really nice to see. Um, oh, oh my god, thank you so much. Um, um, I did my makeup for like the first time in like three years or something well just my eyeliner and it looks nice i've um never done it this way so it's just kind of fun to do something a little bit different <laughs> um 
Oh, Crybaby Whims. Yeah, don't worry about it. I posted a upload schedule this week for, um, oh my god, let me check. I forgot already because it's a little bit different. I think that Crybaby Whims is coming on, um, sorry, I'm just opening up my schedule because I forgot low key. <laughs> um, I, cr I think that Crybaby Whims is, yeah, it's on Friday, so it's on its usual day. It's just some other, other things are a little bit different. Um, but, oh, hi, hi, welcome. Oh, thank you. I, I really like the eyeliner. I, I think I do. I was, it, it took me ages, not gonna lie, because it was just so uneven. Um, I did it at like 4 p.m. Because um, I just wanted to test it and then I did it like kind of okay. And then I just sat with it like for like four hours because I knew that I couldn't like recreate that thing. <laughs> so I was just there like with my eyeliner, nothing else um, for like the entire afternoon. It was like a mess. <laughs> Um, oh, it's gonna be a good episode of Crybaby Whims. It's it's a nice one for Rosalie. It's still nice when things are like kind of peaceful and nice and just like a normal teen life. I feel like things will start like picking up and be like, a little bit more like stressful in the next maybe few episodes, but we still have some like peaceful nice times going on, so I think that that's kind of good. Um, I didn't make any Sims. Um, I mean, I didn't do any makeovers of the Sims that you did quite yet because I haven't actually like been in the game at all because I was away for like a really long time. Um, well, it was just two weeks and maybe just like a bit before I was like preparing for the trip. So I haven't done any makeovers of any of the townies on the hashtag. So it's going to be like a little bit because I also pre-recorded um, Crybaby Whims. Sorry, I'm just like looking to the side because like... I think I explained it in my last stream, my setup is a little bit awkward. So I'm like looking at the laptop where the chat is on like completely on the side. So sorry, I know it's kind of weird. I need to like reshuffle my entire setup because like the camera's here, my main monitor is here and then the laptop is like all the way there. <laughs> um, but yeah, I haven't, I haven't done any like makeovers of your townies quite yet. Um, but it's gonna be in the next few episodes because it usually takes me a while to get those done as well because I need to like replace all the bits that I don't have, maybe like the packs that you use or CC. So I just do quite a bit to like get them ready for the game and everything. So that's just kind of how it is. Um, but do you want me to maybe start? Because I'm always just like feeling a little bit weird at the start because I don't know what to chat about. So I'm just like really eager to start because like I don't know what to talk about. I don't know how to do like intro chit chats. <laughs> but you can tell me how you're all doing and what did you do for like the last, I don't know, two weeks? Because we haven't really chatted for like a while. Even, even th three weeks, I think. Because I haven't streamed before leaving, I think. So it's been quite a while. Um, oh, yeah, Flora, um, she's fine still, don't worry, she's fine, but she's really old. That's all I'm gonna say, Flora is, like, really, really old at this point. I don't think that she has a lot left. I actually don't know how long she has. I think that maybe, yeah, another couple episodes. I feel like we will really have, like, good two, three episodes, and then things will start being, like, really different. But I, I don't know yet, <laughs> and I don't want to spoil anything. But, oh, hi, uh, welcome, and, oh, you also went on vacation, oh my god, a lot of vacations happening. I mean, yeah, I guess spring break was, um, happening as well, so, kind of nice overlap for vacations and stuff. But let me just pull up the wheel that we use, and I can just, like, slowly start. <laughs> um, so, I still use the same wheel that I used in the first one. I did say that I'll split these into like two different ones for like bigger decisions and smaller decisions but the problem is that I haven't had a chance to actually do that because there's like a lot to reorganize and change so I'll still use this one just for this episode which I know is maybe a little bit like too chaotic it's like a really big range of things that we have on here but I think that I will um just use it for this one because I just I couldn't really like remake it so we'll just use what we have right now and I think I'll spin it I think I will spin it three times like we did last time and then maybe like an extra spin or two depends on like what we get but um let me just catch up what did you do um oh you have to go back to uni tomorrow oh that sucks 
um yeah I, I haven't been to uni since like October and I I could not imagine going back so like good luck I hope it went it goes like well for you and that you enjoy your time there despite it like kind of you know sucking because it's nicer to be on vacation for sure um true we're talking about flora on the stream about nilani we should be focusing on her so let me just spin for the first thing that we're doing with her today and what's that gonna be there's like a really big range of things so let's just see oh oh okay add the haunted house traits wow we're really just touching into some like occult little not so human bits okay i like that um should we spin for the next one um oh yeah that's actually a good question um should we like remove things i mean sure once we like complete them i could remove them but like when it comes to buying a goat um i wouldn't mind if we got like buy a goat every time you know <laughs> like getting like 50 goats quite challenging but stuff like this that you can like pretty much just do once like re like add the haunted house house thing i will get rid of but some smaller things like getting pets and stuff i will not i'll not i'm not gonna get rid of it right now because i'll just um change the wheel anyway so i can just remove it then <laughs> but yeah that's actually a good point i was thinking about that and i think that once we like remove things i will um i mean once we complete things i will remove stuff um so okay let's spin for the second one and see what else do we need to do because like adding the haunt haunted house thing is really quick to do <laughs> but it's gonna be difficult to deal with and <gasps> have an affair wait let me just think about this does Nailani have like an official partner yes i think that she's dating i think that we were like chasing jay and that didn't work we went with morgan oh i can't remember i guess i will check but we do have to have an affair on whoever it is so good luck whoever is her partner i genuinely can't remember that's crazy but for the final one well, let me just catch up on the chat so a little bit of like waiting on this um oh yeah you have to see the outfits right she has like this entire clown core makeover and you haven't seen it it's actually quite crazy <laughs> maybe i went a little bit too far you'll see in a second but that's so true oh my god i i forgot that you have to see that i maybe should have showed you that before we did this the wheels it doesn't matter but still um Oh, oh, she's with Morgan. Oh, oh no, we love Morgan. I, I feel bad hurting them, but okay, let's, let's just see what the final thing is and buy a cat. Okay, that's fine. We don't have money. Oh, that's, that's gonna be difficult. We don't have money, but all right. I feel like we're kind of okay. So that's all right. So now we kind of have to, I think, jump into the game and actually oh, get all of this going. So Nilani, who's just currently watching a bit of a TV. What am I doing? Oh my God. Sorry, I'm confused. Why is this like a little, a little weird? It shouldn't be like this. Okay, whatever, it's working. So I'll just leave it like this. Anyway. Um, let's maybe just jump into cast first because you have to see her outfits and everything. So, I can't remember what my cast background is. Hopefully it's something nice and appropriate. Maybe I, maybe I did leave it as like a Sulani one. I think I did. Okay. And this is the outfit that you've seen last time. I think that we did this one together and it's like kind of okay. I kept it, at least I tried to keep it kind of like islandy and stuff. Oh, right. And I did get some um, recommendations for like different hairs because I don't really have like a big variety of the hairs that she needs to have. So like ginger and dreads and like very long. That was the problem. And I forgot to download more. I did download one that I used quite a bit. But anyway, let's <laughs> let me show you <laughs> the rest of the outfits because they are like kind of a lot some of them i mean to be fair i really love them i i really just went like all in and downloaded a lot of cc specifically for her and i really li like it it's just 
I think I did go a little bit too crazy because like I did look at some inspo on Pinterest and it was all just normal outfits, just really colorful, but I really wanted to go like kind of a lot <laughs> and I think I really like it. It's just, what is this? Okay, this is not the outfit. I think I accidentally added that one. Okay, interesting. Um, that's not even one of the outfits is <laughs> where are these outfits coming from oh my god that's so embarrassing <laughs> um but this is her formal look it's so pretty i mean it's as formal as it can be with this sort of style right well let me know what to think i kind of i kind of like it i haven't seen these outfits in a bit because i did them like at this point two weeks ago more like three weeks ago so i kind of forgot so i'm really liking this i also gave her this like little thing that's like not really a tattoo because she's not supposed to have a tattoo quite yet but we can just say that she like just did that with like markers or whatever it's not like a real tattoo so i feel like it's okay um <laughs> with their shoes the like different shoes i really love that that's like so funny i think that she's like pretty much the only sim ever that i'll be able to use that on but it's just way too good not to right um but let me continue so we have athletic which is like kind of pretty much normal it's just colorful because it is just athletic i couldn't really do that much like craziness on there but we also have sleepwear which is also just really like colorful but that's kind of it i tried to go with this like rainbow um look oh my god i hate this overlay i'm using my partner's laptop until mine gets sorted out because it's still like a bit of a mess so i'm just like I hate this thing, but I don't want to remove it. <laughs> um, but anyway, if that pops up anytime in the gameplay, sorry about that. I just... It's a lot not working in your own setup. But anyway, this is her party look. And I really try to keep her, like, island aesthetic as well as, obviously, clown core. So it's... You know, I tried to do that in all of the outfits, but I couldn't really because it was really hard to find CC that's matching both. So I tried to do that at least in one outfit. And I feel like this one is really, really showing that so well. I really like it. Um, okay, I think that you're loving the outfit so far. The hair is so crazy and colorful. Yeah, it is. It's just so pretty. That orange skirt does look really good on her, doesn't it? It's just so nice. And okay, the swimwear is looking pretty normal. Again, I haven't like made the outfit. That's so weird. Why is it doing that? Okay, whatever. Um, oh, the <laughs> okay, the hot weather wear is just so funny as well. I I don't even remember this one, but it's just so fun. I I really love it. And I think I did also try to keep a little bit orange in there, at least to some extent, because we did agree that orange looked really good on her. So I think that that was also the thinking there. And the cold weather, I mean, her hair is looking like really different in this, but I really wanted to use a hat and none of the hairs that she used agreed well with hats. So I had to change it. So it's not really like realistic, I guess, um, but at least it's, you know, it's just kind of matches the things so i guess that it's good enough and this other one look <laughs> look this one is <laughs> this outfit is like crazy 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 properly crazy but i think that it's um fun enough to like it's experiment at least for a bit so <laughs> um oh did i see the eclipse no i haven't because it's like so cloudy i didn't even bother i i was like kind of freaking out because my partner um said that like hey the eclipse is gonna be visible at like 7 57 or something and i was like i'm streaming at eight like what because <laughs> i knew it was happening i just didn't really think much about the time um but then i started freaking out that no one's gonna be at the stream because everyone's gonna be looking at the eclipse um which probably is maybe the case because i feel like a lot of people are like interested because like why wouldn't you be but i didn't even bother because it's like so cloudy and we also don't have like the special glasses for that and i i don't want to go blind over that so <laughs> i just gave up but if any of you have seen any of it let me know because it's kind of pretty interesting but the outfits wait why is she why is the top of the screen like cut off oh my god what's happening with that Hmm, okay, that's interesting. I know that it's black now. Sorry, just give me a second to like troubleshoot this because 
it shouldn't be like that. So let me just, let me just check. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh my God. Sorry. I didn't even realize that you were like looking at the screen all zoomed in. Hopefully you didn't miss anything on the outfits. I didn't realize that. Sorry. Um, oh, a NASA live stream. I mean, yeah, that makes sense that they would have a live stream. I didn't even think about that. That's, that's pretty good. Yeah. You can definitely watch that on the live stream. Sure. Um, that, that does make sense. Sorry, I just didn't even consider that. That's kind of smart. Um, but I don't know, watching it on a live stream, for me at least, it wouldn't really feel like, like it's real, you know? So I, I guess I just didn't really think about it. My mom actually sent me like some kind of like TikTok live stream and I was like, um, cool, but I'm not really gonna bother, bother watching. I don't know why, I'm just like... It just feels so detached in a way. Oh my god, I don't want to go into like a weird rant, but it's just, I don't know. <laughs> it's weird to me that like experiencing stuff like that on live streams, it just doesn't make sense. I say well, live streaming, right? But yeah. Anyway, um, I already forgot what we need to do. We need to cheat on her partner, which I need to check who that is. Oh, I think it's Morgan. Oh, right. Um, Morgan. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry if I just freaked you out there with yelling. But I gave Morgan a makeover and Jay as well. So you need to see those. I think I posted them on my... Oh my god, I love that. I think I posted them on my community tab like ages ago, but maybe I haven't. So this is Morgan's first outfit. I tried to keep their style, but just yassify them a little bit. Um... Um, just, just looking at the chat, sorry. I, I'm still getting used to, like, keeping all of that in, like, in track. Um, what do I think is my aesthetic? Oh my god, see, that question is really difficult. While I talk, I'll just show their outfits. But, <laughs> absolutely slaying this. Sorry, I completely forgot about their outfits, so I'm just, like, so surprised to see this. But I don't know what my aesthetic is. And that's kind of honestly a bit problematic because, ooh, because it's really difficult to like pick my, you know, personal style because I feel like I don't really have an aesthetic. So it's really just so hard to actually pick things. And I wish I would have like an aesthetic and everything would be in that aesthetic because it's just, it looks so nice and cohesive, but I don't have that. So it's it's really a struggle. That's something that I'm kind of trying to find, but it's just not really happening, unfortunately. And the loading screen, which I'll show in a second. Yeah, it is CC. Um, I think it's by... Oh, I can't really remember, but I'm sure if you looked up CC loading screens, you would find this one really quickly because I just use like pretty much anything and just put it in there so it looks nicer for the stream so this one is like one of the first ones that came up honestly <laughs> i just uh picked that one because it matches actually my like channel colors and everything um um Oh yeah, I did. I did put it on the community tab. Thank you. I think I put Morgan on there, but I didn't actually put Jay. So you can put. So you can actually take a little look at him as well. I don't know. I kind of like how he turned out. Actually, this is a pretty good tiny makeover. Um, but it's it's like very basic. I think I didn't really bother too much with Jay because we kind of have gotten rid of him already. I think at this point. I can't really remember too much, but yeah, that's that's Jay as well. Just gave him a little makeover because he was like a character for a bit. But now we can focus on breaking Morgan's heart, right? <laughs> that's like so bad. I forgot already that we need to be cheating on them. I'm not too happy about that, but okay. Wait, oh, um, did it say cheat or affair? Please, please, please remind me because I see those as very different. So I think it was an affair and that means that we need to keep it secret, right? Because, you know, I wanted to do like a fair secret. Cheating is like, I think that we got cheat with Jay. Yeah, yeah, we did. Okay, affair is secret. Okay. Oh, <laughs> the ad jump scared you? Oh my god, okay. Well, at least I know that the ads are running. <laughs> Sorry, um, that, that's really funny. Um, it'd be like that. Okay, affair, affair. Um, 
and we also need to buy a cat and oh go into build mode right we need to be doing no thanks to this oh my god please stop no sounds good goodbye sounds bad just leave me alone anyway we need to be actually turning this into a haunted house um so that's gonna be great well i mean i'm not too upset about it because it's not that difficult to deal with but still so now we need to be actually earning a bit of money to buy a cat and i don't mean adopt i really actually do mean buy because those are like different things so let me just see how much a cat would actually be because we do have adopt here um adopt there there should be like uh isn't there Hmm. I really thought that you could, like, buy... I'm just so confused. Maybe I was thinking that because of the horses. Oh yeah, you can, like, rescue a horse for cheaper, but you can purchase a horse for more. I thought that the same thing would apply to, like, cats and dogs. I guess either way we need 200, and then some more for, like, cat things. Okay, that's fine. And how is a little Peach doing? How are you doing? Do we want to, like, say hello to you? Do like a little hug to Peach because we haven't seen you in a couple of weeks. <laughs> so might as well just say hello to you. Um, okay, you're being like quite friendly. You don't need anything, so that's good. I think that Nelani's getting a little tired. Oh, you're so cute. Oh, oh my god. I absolutely love that. But Nelani's getting a little tired, which is a bit annoying. Um, so we can maybe send you upstairs. Oh, didn't we have, like, Jay maybe sleeping over for a bit? We did. Jay is still staying over for, like, three nights. Um, that's crazy. Where are you? You're not here. Um, okay. <laughs> Interesting, sure. Oh, an affair with Gidri! Oh, Geneva would be mad. <laughs> um, sure, we can try to have an affair with Yidri. If he shows up, at least that's going to be easy because that little guy, <laughs> for, you know, no, not trying to call him any mean names, so I'm just going to say a little guy. He is quite uh, flirty. Um, I'm feeling a little upset with him because of my Not So Human series where he was... Um, cheating on my main sim <laughs> um but yeah if we see Gidri, we could try to actually hook up with him um i mean he probably will be showing up anytime now oh we had someone at the door was that jay maybe oh that is jay that's really awkward though <gasps> oh do you have do you have like a fear of being cheated on isn't that ironic oh my god okay and you want to talk over relationship fears with Jay, who you cheated on. That's absolutely crazy. And she's acting kind of crazy as well. So I guess that's how, that says a lot. But oh my god. That's <laughs> She's just a gift that keeps on giving, I swear. But anyway. Oh, you might have to go soon. Okay, don't worry about it. You can catch up any time that you need. Um... But, okay, what are you doing? Where did you get that food? Sorry, I'm just so confused. She's just so chaotic. Where's Jay going? Are you... Oh my god, okay. You're not even wearing an outfit that I gave you. Where's that outfit coming from? Um, I think that my MCC is just doing some weird bits and adding outfits to Sims. So that's really nice to find out when I'm live. <laughs> but, okay. It is what it is. Let's try to chat with Jay for a little bit until we wait for... Oh, I was gonna say, until we wait for Ghidri to show up. Okay, uh, well, it's not Ghidri. It's just finding out that she's in a haunted house. But we can handle this, that's fine. Um, but where's the Ghidri pop-up? Doesn't that come on, like, the first night in a haunted house? It might actually be tomorrow. So we'll just try to speed run like, tomorrow and wait for the evening. But now we can just kind of try to... I don't know, chat with Jay for a bit, although it is a bit, like, awkward. Reassure about faithfulness. I don't think that we should, honestly. Wait, were you two actually dating? I need to remind myself, because it's just been so long. Oh. He's actually her boyfriend. Really? Are you, like, properly together with Morgan, then? Oh, they're just lovers. 
Huh. I guess the... Okay, that's interesting. We never made things official with Morgan. Anjay is still her boyfriend. I guess that's why I gave him a makeover. But that could actually be really good news for Morgan. Because maybe we don't have to hurt their feelings. Because she could just have an affair with someone like a third person. Because that would check a box. I mean, it checks the box either way, right? It doesn't have to. Because like, no one's going to know. Sorry, I'm just contradicting myself completely. Oh, hi. Welcome to the stream. Oh, maybe it's the career outfit. You're so right. It could be. It's just a little weird because um, she also had some random outfits in cast when I was showing the outfits. So I'm just a little confused. Um, um, oh, maybe you're mixing up. No one moved in with Nelani last time, but Jay came over to stay for like quite a few days and he's still staying until Friday so maybe that's what you're thinking about because yeah he came over on Tuesday and he's staying until Friday like that's like a while he just made himself welcome in our home <laughs> so maybe maybe you're thinking of that but what are you off to do so you just off to go take a little shower can I do anything that would be like summoning oh okay we have we have stuff here so I can mop that up and maybe Ghidri is going to be like, yeah, you took care of that real good. <laughs> I just I just need Ghidri to show off because I really want to be having that affair with him. Um, but I think that we might have to wait until tomorrow because I think that he does show up like the night after. Oh, you're just going to sleep there. All right. Fair enough. I completely forgot that Jay was actually her, like, official boyfriend and Morgan was not a partner. That's so silly. But, alright, you're- oh, you're just so stinky. Alright, sure, whatever. Go take a little shower. And I'll just think about stuff that we can do for money around the house just so we get enough to actually get that cat. Oh, we have a little spectre here. Hi. We can, um, well, we can just chat with you for a bit. While she's just being so stinky. I really hate it when Sims like don't even finish taking a shower. That's so frustrating. It happens every time. I swear if you do like, if you queue up any actions in the shower, it just gets cancelled. It's so annoying. Um. Oh, don't worry about going. Yeah, you can catch up with the VOD anytime. So like, don't worry about it at all. But thank you for coming over. Um, but how did this go? Did the specter actually like you? Um, oh, okay, you just like fitness. Okay, I don't care. Um, let's try to attempt that communication because I kind of missed it. So let me just take a little look a little bit more. Um, I think that the specter is still staying kind of happy. Are you? Maybe. I mean, so far it's looking like it's kind of going well, isn't it? It would be so funny if she was better at this than like um Geneva is. I don't I don't think that she is. Oh. Well that looks like it was like a really pleasant chat. <gasps> Are you off to chat with Makoa? That's a development. What do we think about Makoa? Hmm. Oh, odd jobs. Oh my god, you're so right. You're a genius. Um I mean I'm not really sure if I should. <gasps> Wait, this is this is my first ever clown core sim that I did when I was also doing like the little wheel the side thing. It would be so fun to have her like a little friend. That's so funny that she actually showed up here. Let's try to have them be like little clown friends. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. I actually really love that. I think that she's a teen though. No, she's not. Oh my gosh, they can actually be like little clown core friends. That's so cute. All right, let's try to... Wait, what is this mood like? I've never seen this. Really weird dream. Huh. Oh, high maintenance. Right, okay. I forgot that she had that trait as well. But you two are little clunk or friends who absolutely hate each other. But that's interesting that... Well, Nilani thinks that April... Oh, April, okay. That you're admirable, but she thinks that you're clingy. Okay, that's interesting. I mean, I guess that you are quite desperate. Talk about rainbows, because you're both dressed like rainbows. That's cute. But yeah, I guess that she is quite desperate to, like, make a friend. <laughs> um, Fair enough. But, I mean, make friends with her, because she's, like, really 
really, really a proper friends material. Oh, thank you. I think that she's also really cute. It was just so fun to experiment with this style for like the first time, but it also is like a bit of a challenge because now whenever I think of like clown core outfits, I just think of like this sort of deal, which it is that, but then I just like find myself repeating this exact outfit. So <laughs> she is the blueprint in my mind. So that's quite funny. Oh, they're kind of well, they're not really hitting it off, but they're trying to. So that's, you know, something. Oh, I wish we, that we had, like, Simolins to go in the lottery. But, th yeah, you're right. I could do odd jobs. Oh, let me just change up your phone a little bit. Why not? Let's just do something random, just so it's, like, a little bit more colorful. But, odd jobs. I can definitely do that. I mean, I'm feeling a little sussed out to do that because the wheel didn't say that we are allowed, <laughs> but I can just, just a little bit. It's not like a main source of income, but right now it technically is because it's like we have no income. Oh, I just went to look for a job. Okay, whoops. Um, oh no, she's getting yelled at. Oh, annoying. All right. Um, Oh, they're not available during the night. Okay, we need to check that in the morning. Oh, and this little clown core girl was evil. That's so funny. And you're feeling a little sick. You're still stinky. Is that why you're like feeling so sick? All right, she's talking to herself. I think that we just need to send her home. Back to the specters. <laughs> okay, back to the specters. Um, back to Jay freaking out in her room. Interesting. But let me just have you take a shower and see what Jay is doing. Are you feeling a little spooked or why are you in my bedroom just eating fish? You, you're gonna make my bedroom stink like fish. That's just not not fair, is it? <gasps> He's gonna leave that plate there. That's just so rude. You know what? I'm gonna put that in on, on like your pillow or something there. I mean... It is my house, I'll be the one cleaning it, so maybe I shouldn't, but there, that's gonna be next to his head. He's sleeping right here, so like, good luck. Anyway, <laughs> um, let's, let's just focus on whatever she's supposed to be doing. So, we have the haunted house thing, still no Ghidri, but I feel like Ghidri is a really good call, so we will wait until, I'm pretty sure tomorrow, tomorrow night. Um, the goat is doing quite well. I wish I could just maybe like wake you up and get a little simoleon here or there. What am I talking about? <laughs> what did I try to say? Oh my god. I just wanted to say that we need to be milking this goat for simoleons. That, that's what I was trying to say. I don't know how, but I tried to say that. Anyway, let's try to also clean up the house a little bit because Jay is... Oh, Jay is actually cleaning it up. I was gonna say, Jay is making everything stinky. I guess that you don't have to then. But it is 2 a.m. I don't really want her sleep schedule to be like really messed up. Let's just try to communicate with the specters for just like a little bit longer. Just to see how that goes. Cause I'm kind of because I'm kind of curious. I don't think it's really doing that much, especially when it comes to money. I don't think that we can really make money on these little bastards, so it doesn't really matter. Um, but as long as they're happy, I guess I don't really have much to complain about. Um, but I guess that we do maybe need to go to sleep. And that went well as well. But we do need to go to sleep. Where are you going now? You're gonna go... I didn't tell you to dance. Go to sleep. I want to go to sleep. So we're like speed running the night so we can go do an odd job i think oh and jay is sleeping as well okay good so things are quite peaceful no gidri anywhere and oh it's bunny day today okay that's fun oh. we could be having an affair with the fl mm, actually can we do that can flower bunny be romanced i don't know i think not maybe i guess that i'll check <laughs> uh i'm just feeling flirty okay that's good wait why is this used as a mini fridge? That's, I mean, it is a mini fridge, you know what I mean? It's just kind of nasty because it's supposed to be for like masks and stuff and not for food. I don't like that that's in her bedroom. I'll leave it because it's like cute, but I hate that she can just pull out like chicken stir fry as soon as she rolls out of bed. That's just crazy. Okay, whatever. What's this pen thing? Oh, start a new relationship. Why did I pin that last time? I can't actually remember. 
Oh, I can collect the eggs and sell them. You're a genius. Yes, I will be doing that. They don't really sell for, for much, I think. They sell for like 20, 30 simoleons or something. I think that's just the rare ones sell for a little bit more. But still, we need any sort of simoleons for the cut that we need to buy. So I'll just hunt for the eggs and hope for the best. I mean, and we might as well try to... Oh, we have a lot of pads as well and tampons and stuff because I just went a little crazy last time. I bought too many. Oh, because I needed to spend all the money, right? But there, we have generous 20 simoleons, but at least it's something. So we are earning a bit of money. So we can maybe just go hunt for eggs there. That's such a genius plan, actually, because we can just... We can get a couple hundred simoleons, I think, and we'll probably complete this collection. Not that it matters, but it's just like a fun little thing. Oh, can't flop. Oh no, can't romance flower bunny anymore. Yeah, I thought that that was an option before, but I guess that they just got rid of it. Because, I mean, I get, I get why, because it is a little weird to do, but it, it, it's fun. <laughs> um, But still, all right, whatever. Let's just try to... Oh, we can, you can spend money there. Okay, good to know. Um, wish I knew that when I actually needed it. But anyway, let's try to hunt for the eggs just everywhere. Sell the ones that I have. Because I just really want to get that cats today so we can just get that out of the way. And I won't sell, like, all of these, but I kind of want to get... Um, okay, this is actually a good, good hack. I will just, like, put a couple of these out here because she doesn't need them. But she doesn't really need that many, so I can just, like, pull a few here. And now I can sell everything. Oh, that's nice. Okay, that's nice. And I think I'm allowed to do that. <laughs> um, Just, like, a bare minimum, at least something. So, okay, let me just put all that back. Oh my god, that's so annoying, actually. <laughs> I, I regret doing this, but at least it gave us money so we can buy the cats and actually um, get some like food bowls and stuff because I was concerned that we won't be able to do that, but now we can, I think, I think. Um, we won't be able to get the litter box though, which kind of sucks for the cat, not gonna lie. But let's go, ooh, let's go repair this, maybe. Maybe that would be a good idea. We also have some haunted bits still around. Even during the day. I thought that those disappeared during the day. That's interesting. You are freaking out. I love to see that, honestly. But okay, nothing else upstairs. So let's just work on fixing all of these bits. And then we can officially, actually, get that cat. I still feel like... I still feel like we can do that for free, but I guess not. So let's just do it that way. And I really hope that Gidri shows up tonight, because if not, we might have to change our plan. I'm not really sure how we're going to be doing that, because uh, as like secret, because um, Jay is still here, so it's going to be a little tricky. Maybe I won't actually bother with mopping the symbol, because that's just... Oh, actually, you know what? Let's have into our parts here because we can get some simoleons from that. Um, I'm just being like super desperate here, but the wheel is just not letting me earn money. But okay, now we can actually go and um, where is it? Adopt a cat. So that could be a little friend for our goat. So let's see what's offered. I don't think I want to get a kitten because I just can't be bothered. Um, actually, it doesn't really matter. They just won't be able to go down the stairs. But who are we thinking? Um, we'll definitely change the name. And I'm open for suggestions. But first, let me help pick a cat. I'm kind of thinking that Nacho is super cute. But what do you think? Oh, yeah, we could go um, to Brendan to Bay. But honestly, that would just be too much work. It's I just don't want to do that right now because befriending them is just, it is kind of difficult, but at the same time, oh no, it did say um buy a cat, sorry, yeah, it didn't say adopt, it did say buy, so either way, I do have to pay, so true, this is good, I was just a bit confused, but 200 simoleons, yep, I actually do need to pay because it did say buy a cat on the wheel, so we're good. 
Um, so what are we thinking? You like Nacho? I, I like him as well. I feel like he really matches um, Nelani's, I don't know, colors and everything. He's just really cute. So I feel like Nacho is uh, the way to go. Um, yeah, the wheel said um, bye, if I remember correctly. So I feel like we're kind of good on that. Oh yeah, Smeagol is also really cute. Wait, it was that this this one? Yeah, it is this one. It's really cute. I did I did just like look at this one just before this one, and I was like, mm, these two are really cute, and this one as well. Oh, are these two from the same litter or something? They're so similar. That's so cute. Okay, they're not really, but I'm kind of feeling like Nacho should be it. Okay, let's just go with Nacho. Well, to be fair, we do have to actually introduce ourselves and see if we even like Nacho. But is the adoption person coming? Please don't tell me it's broken. Oh, there they are. Okay. Um, okay, there you are. And where- oh, there you- what did I just say? There you are. I just wanted to say that. Oh my god. I'm just making noises at this point. <laughs> I'm just seeing a cat and I just go feral. Okay. Um. Anyway, you are terrified. Are you scared of cats? Look at Peach. Oh, being so stinky and starving and dirty. That's such a bad impression for the adoption agents. Okay. Let's let's maybe try to take care of the goats first, because I feel like Nailani doesn't even like cats that much. <laughs> Cause she got scared immediately. I know it's unrelated, but still, it's like interesting timing, right? So let's try to take care of this little guy, maybe clean you and give you like a little feed. And oh, we can actually sell this. That's real good. Maybe it wouldn't be like great to sell it, but Oh, that's like quite a bit of money. That's actually quite a comfortable amount of money. So I will definitely sell it. Uh, yeah, I was thinking the same thing for like, I, I want to get like not a kitten because it would just be annoying for like a kitten to not be able to move places. And if you have the right traits, you could also be earning me some money. So I'm just like not too mad about it. <laughs> um, Hopefully, I I'm kind of hoping that you actually have some traits that could be like... The little, the little hunting thing, what's it called? I forgot. But the one that like brings you collectibles, the feathers and stuff. Oh, Jay, are you going to be introducing yourself to Nacho? Oh, Nacho is not a friendly cat. Okay, great. Um, hello? Why is Nox dressed like that and coming into my house? Hello? Sir? <laughs> okay, what are you gonna do? Just coming over to like clean up my trash or just complain about it even better Okay, no, he is cleaning up. I'm just who let you in? Why? You know what? Okay, let's let's focus on the cats and Just forget about Nox for a second, but I'm just so confused <laughs> I'm just so confused. I mean this series is is like meant to be like just chaos confusing, but it's just a lot Oh, they're kind of friendly Oh, they're not. They hate each other. Okay, let's calm him down. He's feeling kind of scared as well. She's hiding, like, on the toilet. Interesting. Um, but I feel like everyone's just feeling a little bit uncomfortable in the house. I think that that's because of this. So maybe I should be cleaning that up. Oh, she's too scared to go near it. Okay, sucks. Um... But I think that regardless of the issues, I do actually want to adopt Nacho. Yeah, let's get Nacho immediately. He was being mean to Jay instantly. He was mean to Nilani instantly as well, so that's telling me something. But I think that maybe we should give him a chance. Okay, let's ju let's just adopt you, not even bother with the traits. He's being brave about the symbol, so that's good. And oh, I see the flower bunny there. Oh, you'll be leaving flowers, right? That's actually kind of good, isn't it? So we can actually sell those. I know that I could plant them, but I honestly just don't want to bother, uh, but it would be kind of smart. Maybe I should, but we are trying to adopt Nacho. Is it not working? Oh my god, if it's not working, I'm gonna lose my mind. Please work. I'm having some issues with... Oh, of course it's not working when you're just on the fridge. All right, he already is acting like he's owning the house, so I feel like he's just making himself quite at home here, so I feel like we should adopt him, but... um. 
why is it not working? <laughs> please, Nacho, please let me adopt you. Well, please get off the fridge. I feel like that's the problem. Just get off the fridge. This cat is so frustrating, but he matches the house so nicely with the colors and everything. I feel like he matches a bit too well. It's gonna be hard to see him around the place. Oh my god, do I need to like reset you or something? Because you're like, you're being so annoying. Um, let's try that again. She's feeling so scared and uncomfortable. Oh my god. It's just... Please don't do this. Why is adopting this cat like the most... The most challenging part of this. You know what? I'm just gonna get him off the fridge in the most annoying way possible and just teleport him to her. So just give me a second to do that because it's just not happening. Okay, lots him to her and that'll be Nacho. There we go. Hopefully she can actually adopt him now. Otherwise, it's just not working. I think it's fine. There we go. Okay, finally. So let's just get him and now you can actually suggest some names yeah i was gonna do that i was gonna just add him to the family if this didn't work i was gonna do that exact same thing because like i i was just losing my patience there but let me hear some name suggestions i mean i'm kind of open to nacho because it's like silly enough but we could go with something a little bit sillier <laughs> So, what are we thinking? We have the goat that's named Peach. So we could go in the similar direction or we could, or we could like go into something completely different. But it kind of would be nice to have them be like themed. So I'm not like fully sure. Oh, you have to go. Okay, that's fine. But thank you for coming by. Um, I'm really bad at naming pets, so I'm kind of thinking, I kind of want to go into actually more of a like clowncore aesthetic sort of name, um, just to like celebrate this style because it might change at some point. So I feel like it'll be kind of a fun one, but I don't have any ideas. Um... Oh my god, I'm completely just blanking on this. <laughs> you know what? I have I have a bit of a, a weird idea. What if we just call this one J? Because like J is Nelani's personal clown because she's gonna be cheating on him for with like a lot of people at this point. Because <laughs> they still haven't broken up. So I feel like calling this one J. How do you actually spell J's name? Is it just like J as in the letter or is it like J? No, I feel like it's just the letter. So from his point of view, it'd be kind of cute. Maybe a little weird if his girlfriend named her cat after him, but we know that it's just celebrating the clown part of him. I feel like I'll just go with J. So welcome, Jay, to the household. It is a little weird because it is just like one letter. If it looks like it's a mistake, is it actually like J as in just like one J? Yeah, it is. Oh my god, that's so weird. Okay, <laughs> it is what it is. Um, so we have Jay and household, and um, oh, the adoption lady is she coming over to get that crate? Because that's like really in the way. Mm, okay, whatever. Um. <laughs> the superior J, I agree. Um, but I need to get some like cat bits, so um what is this? Okay. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Um we need to be getting the cat things before I need to spend money on anything else. So J can eat. <laughs> um You know what? We'll just get the automatic feeder because I just can't be bothered. So where can we put that so it's not like too much in the way this is kind of a nice spot for it so let's just put it there and maybe change the color up a little bit there we go and we need a little litter box oh we can't really afford the zappy one 
this one is also like functional, I think, that it scoops by itself. So that's good. It's also a robotic one. We can put that maybe outside so we don't have to like bother with it in the house. And what else do we need? A little a little scratch post so he just doesn't like go fully crazy. We can also put that somewhere. Um well maybe it should be in the house because you know while it's like raining or whatever, he still has something to do. So let's just put that like there. So we can just like hang out in the living room together. Okay, kind of love that. So we have everything that we need for Jay, and we still have like a bit of money. <gasps> Ooh, we have this like from the date with someone at some point so we can just sell that as well so that's pretty good oh and you're meeting the flower bunny aren't you with jay <laughs> your personal bodyguard at this point but what are we feeling about the flower bunny we can just oh we can fight you for eggs okay let's not because you finally have actually good first impressions with someone so you could actually try to be friendly um and let me just see if there is a romance option. Just, oh. Hello. We actually have romance options. We could try. We could try. I was thinking Ghidri, but I'm kind of thinking, why not give it a go? I don't think that we can maybe like woohoo with the flower bunny, but I don't care about that as long as we have some romance. So let's try to, I mean, she's feeling so angry. It's just not really working, is it? Um, where is Jay actually? Because this needs to be an affair, so it needs to be secrets. Okay, you're being upstairs. Being upstairs? What? What? What's wrong with me? But you are upstairs. Um, so we can actually do this. <gasps> and you're feeling kind of confident. Ooh, wait a minute. I need to be careful about her mood because she's just being really moody. But other than that, I I think that we're good. Oh. Ooh, okay. Um, you just reminding me of something. Oh, I have to empty the litter box every once in a while. I, I thought that it gets rid of stuff by itself. Okay, that's annoying. But that reminded me that I actually didn't fill the food here. <laughs> I didn't fill the food. So that's really unfortunate. Oh no, Jay is coming over. Probably flirting with the flower bunny. Um, now I need to be careful. All right, just leave the conversation. Leave the conversation. Go grab the food for for Jay. <laughs> okay, this is gonna get so confusing so quickly. But okay, you two, you two, just be chatting and then. Okay, are you leaving? Okay, not leaving. No, no, no. You're not going anywhere. I need to be. Well, at least building up friendship while Jay is around, and then we'll do like something a little bit different. And I see a flower here, so that's good. So we can sell that. Or maybe I should plant it. It's just annoying that I don't really have that much room to be planting things. Because, like, this is already off the lot. So I think I will just sell them, honestly. It's not even worth it. So, okay, Jay is not looking. He's eating. I can see him up there. So, over oh, hand massage. All right, that's something. Um, oh, that's actually annoying because it's taking like a really long time com to complete. So I'm not really a big fan. But I feel like mm, maybe that's going to build up their friendship. Eh, it's fine. I'll just let them do that. Are you coming over? No. Are you stuck? Hello. <laughs> Hello. Why are you not going? Why are you not moving? Okay. Um, okay. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Anyway, let's just go back to chatting then. Um, she just wants to be mean to him. That's so sad. But I need to keep my eye on Jay. Well, we can try to focus on the flower bunny until Ghidri shows up. And then once Ghidri shows up, I think that we can just switch our focus maybe. Jay is still there with Jay. <laughs> um, I think that they were arguing there for a little bit. And I feel like Jay, the cat, really loves spending his time on the fridge. I'll just allow it. Oh, I was completely right. You're actually obsessed with the fridge. That's so cute. All right. You just have a good time there. And I need to be focusing on this. So, oh, Morgan. Oh, you want to go on a date? <gasps> That's kind of cute, isn't it? Should we go on a date with J with not with Jay, with Morgan? 
It's in the restaurant that we went to, I think, last time. Oh my god, that would be so cute. And we actually get to see your makeover. Um. Oh, I'm not really sure. Oh, there's actually something I just realized that you actually can't see the little thing that I thought talked about like a while ago when I jiggle my mouse. There's like something that shows up and actually doesn't pick up on stream. That's actually good to know. Sorry, I'm just... I, I mentioned it like a while ago and you had no idea what I was talking about. So I'm just, I'm just pointing that out. But what are we thinking? Do we go on a date with Morgan? It's not really like related to anything, but yeah, go on a date. Okay, we're going to the date. It's a little annoying because we were focusing on the flower bunny, but I feel like it's actually, um, oh, I would have to go like pay for the food. Hmm. Actually, I think I maybe have a workaround for that. No, actually, no, I don't. I don't. Okay, we'll just go on the dates and we'll just get something cheap. <laughs> we'll just get, like, whatever. It's not really, like, episode related when it comes to, like, what the wheel decided, but... It's it's nice. <laughs> it's nice. We like Morgan and I kind of want to see what they'll be wearing to the date because I can't remember what the dress code is. Oh, they can like show off each other's makeovers because Morgan, I don't think, has seen Nilani's clown core makeover and she def definitely hasn't seen their nice makeover. So that's kind of fun. Um, and they're spending like a little holiday together. Oh, I really hope, I mean, it's maybe a little bit early to tell because I'll also be including like your sims and everything. And I would definitely like Nilani to be with your sims in the end. Um, so this is more of a, like a placeholder. But at the same time, I'm kind of hoping that Morgan is like the end game because <laughs> they're just so cute. But I was gonna say that it's actually- Oh my god, you can cozy up at the bonfire! I don't think I've ever seen that before, so we can definitely do that. Oh, and she's feeling kind of hungry, so I guess that going to a restaurant is kind of nice. But I guess that it is, like, fair enough. Yeah, she would have to pay, so that's a bit annoying, but we'll just do that. Um, oh, they did a little turtle. That's so cute. Okay. Um... She's having a little meltdown. That's stressing me out. But we can cozy up at the bonfire, which is not even lit. So that's um, interesting. Should we maybe light that for <laughs> No way. You're just like cuddling at the like just a stack of wood. Real real sim activity there. Oh my god. Wait, I need to <laughs> I need to light that bonfire because that's crazy. I mean that's building their romance, so that's really cute. But that's just ridiculous that it's just not even lit and they're like cuddling next to it. So why are you thinking about babies? She's on her period, she's not pregnant, don't worry. It's just freaking me out a little bit. But anyway, cozy up at the bonfire now, because uh, that's actually cute, and it actually does work. Okay, that's cute. Kid, you're just kind of ruining things, thank you, okay. But okay, they bring you real cute. I really like them together. They're actually so adorable. Like, look at that. That's so cute. But anyway, should we maybe go in for, like, a meal? Um, I don't think that Jay is, like, able to be here. I mean, he is just staying over. I'm not controlling him, so he could. But even if he does see, it doesn't matter because he knows that we're cheating with Morgan. So whoever we romance next, which should be Ghidri, we have to keep that one a secret. And Morgan doesn't have to be a secret. So that's at least something. But I think that I was trying to say that um, it's kind of good that we're on this date because... The evening is coming up, like the night is coming up. So when we go home, I think that Ghidra is going to show up. So we can actually do that as well. So the timing of this is like quite nice. It actually gives us something to do. But are we getting seated at the table? It's a bit annoying. Maybe I should have added like tables for just two. Because now we have to like be seated at this big table, which I'm not really a huge fan of. I think that we sat here last time as well. But it's just kind of like nice and private. Oh, I think that we can actually... Oh, we could have requested these. I haven't realized. Okay, well, it doesn't really matter, but this really is overkill for just two people, isn't it? But let's just order for the table. 
she's hungry anyway, but just to save money, we can just get a little water and whatever is like kind of relatively cheap, but I feel like would still fill her up at least. I mean, we don't have to give Morgan food. <laughs> no, we're not, we're not like that broke, but it's, you know, we never know what's going to happen in the future. So I feel like we should be saving money. Oh, we could just get like a really nice cake, coconut cake. Okay. We are being cheap, but it's actually a really cute meal for the date, so I'm pretty happy. Just six simoleons for like a really nice one. Okay, don't worry about it. Don't don't worry about it. Just do whatever you need to do. Take your time. Um, but let's let's get this cake. And hopefully it's gonna be a nice little date. So how are you doing, Morgan? Let's maybe try to do a little bit of flirting. Oh no, why are you coming over? Go away. Oh no, that's the waitress. <laughs> I didn't realize. Okay, you're just you're just being being helpful. That's good to know. But let's try to actually enjoy our time at the date and ask you how you're doing. And should we maybe try to like explain the situation with um Jay? Is that necessary? Um, I don't think I can actually like do much i can't really like say anything about cheating because it's like not really so i'm not gonna bother i don't think that morgan really minds the entire j situation so i'm just gonna leave it that way um so we could just try to have a nice little chat which is um quite good so just do a bit of discussing interests and whatnot what's actually your like chemistry and stuff. Okay, you have like no chemistry. <laughs> um, I mean, I guess that it's neutral then. Uh, you have good first impressions. Sorry, I'm just doing like a little recap for myself because I can't remember. And we don't know one of the traits, but everything else is like kind of good. All oh, right, we had like a little thing with Makoa, just it didn't go anywhere. All right, fair enough. But Morgan, oh my god, I really love their makeover. It's just so nice. I feel weird saying that because I'm the one who did it. <laughs> uh, but it just looks so good, doesn't it? I'm a really big fan of that. Um, let's do like a little deep conversation. That's something that you typically need to do on a date. I, I want this to be marked as a good date. It's just really frustrating that I can't actually see the date objectives. So I need to be like guessing, which I'm not really a huge fan of, but it is what it is. Oh, I found your last trait. Oh, let's try to flirt. She's feeling angry. Okay, you're feeling flirty now. She's just so much to deal with. Do a little like blow a kiss. Is our cake coming over? coming over as it's like a person but i think oh yeah our cake is coming okay that's good we don't really have anyone like relevant here so i don't have to worry about that so our cake is actually it's just here so we can enjoy our food and oh maybe i should have like brought out an actual oh no that's like so much more expensive okay i guess that this was a good good enough choice then and it's probably gonna fill her up um, she's gonna be okay. And, okay, let's, let's just try to maybe fill this for this date. Maybe that should be, like, an objective. Really? <laughs> really? Okay, I'm not gonna deal with that right now. But maybe we should try to fill out the romance, like, fully. And... Then we can go home and see if Ghidri is there because we still need to be focusing on that. Um, and I don't know why, but I'm just like pretty convinced that Ghidri will show up tonight. It should be like that kind of, right? So let's just speed run this real quick. Can you do like frenzied kiss? What does that even do? Okay, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna touch it. But, oh, we can woohoo like right here. <laughs> Interesting. Maybe we'll do that. But when she feels a little... Okay, when she feels a little bit better. No, Morgan, where are you going? Maybe just to the bathroom. Hopefully you'll come back. Um, Morgan? Where are you going? <gasps> don't leave me. Hello, don't be leaving me. Oh my god, okay. Um, you know what? Let's try to just do... Do, do woohoo, just go and uh, go anywhere. 
Because I want them to like celebrate. Oh, you finished the meal, right? So I guess I have to like end the meal and just go home. Because it is 10 p.m. already, so I feel like Adri will be showing up. But we need to be catching up with you real quick, just to like do like a little goodbye woohoo. And then we can go home. This place is like so nice. It's genuinely like so beautiful. Oh, and we can like woohoo on a lot of places. I feel like going <laughs> going on a toilet is like a classic move at this point. Didn't they do that in the last episode? Maybe that was with Jay, to be fair. But where else can we go? Um I mean a lot of them. Oh, I'm not sure what's giving me the last exception. I didn't look at the report just now. I think that it was maybe like the fashion authority mod. I haven't like uh, had a chance to actually look at it. I just turned it off. I didn't want to deal with it just now, but I think it's maybe fashion authority. I think I need to update it. I did update my mods actually today, but since I did move all of my stuff on my partner's laptop, it's just a bit hectic. So I haven't like fully figured out my setup and I don't know which like, version of the mods folder I actually have on here so I'm not really sure which mods I have updated and which I haven't so I think it's fashion authority or something like that because I updated all my main mods literally today but they will be going to woohoo just here not really for any reason I just felt like it would be kind of fun and appro- well inappropriate but <laughs> but appropriate for the date so I'm just gonna let them do that and I think that we paid for the meal so we can go as well and hope that Geetri is going to be showing up. Um, it is 11 p.m. But I mean, if Geetri does show up, he's going to stay there like all night. So I guess I don't have to like worry about it. And she's feeling flirty for another good few hours. Ooh, no protection was used. She's on her period though. So I feel like we're kind of pretty much all right. I don't think that it should be a problem. Um, I'm, I'm a little worried. I'm a little worried, but it's okay. I mean, I low -key did that on purpose because um, it would be kind of fun, but, but I know that she won't be able to get pregnant right now, so it's not like a big deal. Why are you coming over to the table? Do you want to have like something more? Oh, I think I'm just... Oh, you're ordering for the table. What are you ordering? What are you... What are you ordering? Hello? Um... Wait, the waitress is bringing more stuff. No, she's bringing that to some other people. Okay, that's weird. Um... Oh no, I paid for the meal. Ready? No. But my funds didn't change. I'll just... I'll just take the free meal and go. <laughs> I'll just... I'll just take it, you know? Um... And we can just go home and see if Gidra is going to show up. Um, Morgan, I'm not going to invite because I kind of would like to. But if Gidra does show up, we have to do like the entire affair bit. And avoiding Jay is difficult enough as it is because he's in the house. We don't also want Morgan around. So let's just go home by ourselves. And I really hope that we get that pop-up for Gidra. Because if not, if we have to wait for like the entire other night, I might have to pick someone else because it's just way too long isn't it so let's just um see if that's gonna be working i really hope so um oh i didn't pay for the meal i did pay for it though it just didn't work okay whatever you are feeling not even full oh well i guess that a cake is not very nutritious is it all right fine you just go to the bathroom and um, I see that Jay is like freaking out, so I feel like, oh my god, uh, so I feel like, oh no, he was freaking out until I had to like pull the rug <laughs> underneath him, um, but I feel like there is like haunting things going on, going on around the house, because he's really just so upset. I feel like we should probably clean these like little things, because it's just making everyone so uncomfortable and scared, so we might as well focus on that for like a bit. And then I have to figure out if she like needs to eat or something because she apparently wasn't really satisfied with that cake. Um, okay, you know what? You can just have like, oh, I need to pay. Do I have like any leftovers? I think I do. Maybe. Oh, I have a lot of food. A lot of it will actually get spoiled really quickly. But all right, whatever. Um, 
Okay, still no Geetry. That's making me a little nervous, but it is what it is. All right, this is gonna take a while for her to speed that, to clean it up, so I'm just gonna speed it up a bit. But he should have like showed up at this point, right? Hopefully he will soon. All right, um, you just go eat then. The house is just so gross. Um, I think that I need to be asking Jay to actually start like cleaning up around here. But to be fair, he's gonna be leaving. I think that this is his final night here, so I'm not even gonna bother then. Oh, he is cleaning up. I guess that the, <laughs> the the filthy one is Nelani then. Oh, do you wanna give some food to Jay? That's cute. What are you eating? Oh, I don't think that he would really enjoy that, but still, you can give it a go. Making even a bigger mess around the house, I guess, fair enough. Oh, hi, welcome to the stream. Oh, okay, just as we as you showed up, the lights turned on, so I guess that you're just a real good sign here, aren't you? <laughs> no, it's just down, downstairs. Why is upstairs still dark? That's weird. Huh, I've never seen that before. I don't think that we have, like, auto lights on. Hmm, that's... That's actually so weird. Why is that? Okay. Well, still no Ghidri, so I'm feeling a little mad. <laughs> um, bunny day is over. All right, fine. Oh, do we have any more flowers from the flower bunny? No, I'm not really seeing anything. Um, maybe I missed some, I think. <laughs> um, maybe I missed some. Um, no. Okay, she's going to sleep. Really? Oh, well, that's a bit disappointing, isn't it? Well, I don't think I'm missing anything. Because... Yeah. And actually, another thing that I want to check is... um, She should have gotten the little milestone about, like, surviving her first night at the haunted house. And she didn't get that. And this is our second night at the haunted house. A little weird, isn't it? I feel like something's not working as it should. But she's awake already. Just ready to take on another day of chaos. So, yeah, no Ghidri. Maybe we can leave that for, like, the future. Because it's definitely going to happen at some point. But I feel like we should focus on finding someone else today. So... How are we feeling about... Actually, what's her sexuality? I forgot. Um, she is... Okay, she's just attracted to masculine sims. Right, yeah. So, I guess that I was gonna say maybe we should be, like, flirting with this, like, new girl. But no, we can just keep her as, like, an evil friend that we have sometimes. So, who are we gonna be focusing on? I guess Makoa not, because he's just, um... Hard to, <laughs> hard to reach, I guess, because we did try and it just didn't happen. But who are we having this affair with? I'm not really sure. Maybe we should go out somewhere. I don't know. I don't... I still... Oh, maybe because it was a holiday. Do you think? I, I didn't think that it would really affect things, but maybe. You know what? I don't want to go out and look for other people. I really want this affair to be with Ghidri because it's just really fitting. But... Still no Ghidri. You know what? Let's try to just stay home today. Just stay home all day. No matter the calls that we get. Unless it's something like absolutely crazy. But let's try to stay home. And um, maybe just sleep th through the day. So we like speed it up or whatever. And then hopefully tonight we'll actually get the little Ghidri notification. And if not, I'm going to be super upset. But let me just check if maybe... Something got, like, weirdly reset or something. No, it is a haunted house. So, what's up with that? That's so strange. I don't know. Maybe it was because it's a holiday. I, I have no idea. I don't know. I I have a haunted house in my not-so-human. And Ghidri is there, like, all the time. Even during the day sometimes. So, it's kind of weird that he's just not showing up. But, alright, fine. Jay. Oh! Oh, right it's your last day here what are you doing just staring at the plants i think that he's just kind of hating his life right now all right fair enough um but 
yeah, it's gonna be quite easy to have this affair because um, Jay's gonna be leaving, so we don't have to like avoid him around the house because <laughs> he's not gonna be here. At least I think he should be leaving like today, like before the night, or is he like still sleeping tonight? I'm always like really confused. When do they actually leave? I feel like he's not actually sleeping here tonight, but maybe he is. <laughs> I don't know. I think maybe he's leaving like tomorrow morning or tonight like at the evening we'll see i'm always so confused with that but it is almost 10 a.m really early um so definitely no gidri oh i noticed something quite cute downstairs we have a little jay and peach hanging out here together oh it's such a shame that peach can't go on the couch because these two would definitely be napping together that's so cute Oh, I really like them. I love that Peach has a little friend, finally. And I really love that they actually do have, like, actual relationships. So I really hope that they actually get on well. Um, I guess that we could try to see them interact. Okay, nope, never mind. But since, like, I think Horse Ranch came out, animals actually have, like, relationships with each other. So that's real cute. Um, I mean, I'm telling you like you don't know, but you know what I mean. Um... But, Nilani, what can we, like, do with you today? Oh, you know what, actually. Oh, I think that Jay's leaving. Is he not? Oh, I think that he's just going to work. All right. Well, good for you. Couldn't be me, because the wheel said no to that today. Um, But I was gonna go look for Peach and maybe just milk you real quick. Um, Well, actually, I could just do that for Simoleons right there. And, well, we might as well try to, like, interact with you for a little bit, keep you quite happy and everything. But that's gonna be another extra 20, 22 simoleons or something, so that's, like, pretty good. And some things around the house still need to be cleaned up. I'm just honestly tempted to just play through the entire day like this, just because I'm waiting for the evening, but I think it's a bit silly to do that, isn't it? So, um... You know what? I'll do something that's like... Oh, I was gonna say I'll do something that's a bit silly and I was gonna have her do a pregnancy test, but she can't actually have one. So yeah, she's not pregnant. I mean, I knew she wouldn't be, but I just wanted to like do something. <laughs> but it's just not happening, is it? So that's a bit of a shame. Um. Okay, you're just feeling quite happy and flirty, which would be like really ideal for an affair. And your house is, like, so empty. Oh, I'm feeling like maybe we should just, like, try to invite Makoa over and just see how that goes. Like, I'm not too set on him, but we at least have, like, a bit of a foundation on there, so might as well. She does find him basic looking, but he's a neighbor. He's just, he just built, like, coming over super easily. So, oh, she likes video gaming, sure. Um, But, yeah, it's, like, kind of plausible if it makes sense he just come around hang out and they get together oh he's right there already um should we okay she's not feeling flirty anymore um but maybe oh we have a specter immediately this is not gonna go well wait why are you here actually it's noon you shouldn't be here it's noon Alright, I guess the Gigi could show up any time then as well, but he's just not. One time when I actually need him. We can ask him to be woohoo partners. Um, I mean, that's technically an affair, isn't it? They don't have to be like super romantic. They could just be doing that. Um, he says yes. He just said yes. Um, well, he nodded his head. Oh, he definitely said no. Never mind, you can apologize for that. Um, now we have to work on everything all over again. I mean, yeah, he's married, so of course that things would be... Oh, that just built up their, like, friendship all the way up again. Okay, that's interesting. Well, well at least we can just continue. <laughs> just ask him about his day. Oh, welcome back. Well, you didn't really miss that much, to be honest. We're just kind of struggling to, like, find Ghidri. Um, so I decided just now, actually, to try to just... Oh, why is their friendship going up so quickly, actually? Well, I, I decided to try with Makoa just out of, like, desperation because I don't want to be waiting for Ghidri and I just want to get this, like, checklist over. <laughs> um, 
so we can just tr okay no that's actually mean uh we can try to build things up with wait why is that up like so much but jay is at work sorry i'm just like so they now despise each other what happened did you what happened that's so crazy oh my god makawa just go home just just go home this man what even happened there i genuinely have no idea they had like a couple of exchanges of like random things and now they just hate each other i genuinely don't know what happened that's crazy yeah i've i've actually seen that happen before and i still don't know what it is i think it's maybe because uh she either has a terrible reputation which she doesn't um or something 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 about her should be like that she's like bad at talking or something i don't i don't know um I have seen it happen before, but I can't remember what it is. Maybe it's genuinely just like a mod mess up, but I'm not really sure. But that was just so crazy. That was just so stupid. <laughs> um, I guess that we're just going to be staying away from Makoa then. Um, well, are you feeling tired at all? Not really. I'm, I'm feeling a little desperate to try to speed run to get to the evening to see if... Um, and we will get Gidri then, so maybe I should just send her to like go to the bathroom and just go to sleep. Um, just so we have like time going quickly. Uh, until like 7 or 8 or something, because that's when activity usually starts happening, I think. Even sooner, because we have specters now. Wait, why is she feeling so embarrassed? Oh, rejected Woohoo partners, yeah. I mean, that was like quite a lot to just randomly bring up to a guy who's married so i'm not really surprised <gasps> oh my gosh morgan you want to go to another date at the beach as well i actually kind of love that morgan is actually like staying quite local i've never had like a sim do that before it's actually so interesting um this is also just at the beach literally down the street from her house i think and we also went to that restaurant, I think, twice or maybe even three times at this point. You're not, like, asking me to Oasis Springs or whatever. You're really staying on theme. I appreciate that so much. Should we go on this date? I did want um, something to, like, pass my time. So we could just be using Morgan for that, which I feel bad about. But should we go on a date? Um, oh, they were total opposites. Maybe that's what happened. Could be. Um... I don't know if that's something that's like pre-rolled or is that like determined by interactions so i don't know if they're total opposites because so i don't know if that happened because they're total opposites or are they total opposites bef because that happened you get what i mean so but yeah i did see that as well so we're just staying away from the co-op forever at this point but what are we thinking for this date i feel like we should kind of go yeah, go on a date, of course. Um, I guess we'll just see Morgan again. It's it's so funny though, because they're not even like dating officially or anything. So it's just like a cute little thing that they're doing. And Morgan definitely does know that Nelani technically has a boyfriend. Um, I guess that they just don't really mind. So whatever this is, this is, is like, I guess quite casual so i appreciate it i guess <laughs> let's just start off with building oh my gosh cheapskate hour absolute chef's kiss love that why is this infant disappearing okay <laughs> okay but yeah we definitely have some good luck because if we want to get drinks it's gonna be a lot easier but I really love that they're doing like little sand sculptures together whenever they meet up. That's like the first thing that they do. It's so cute. It's like a cute little tradition. I really like it. And oh, if the lighting is like kind of good, I would kind of like to maybe maybe it's like a little bit better there. I kind of want to have them take a little picture together. It would just be like kind of cute. I don't want to get too attached and you probably shouldn't either. But yeah, they are really cute together, aren't they? So, oh, you have a lifestyle in progress. What would that be? Is it like a relationship one? Are you like 
no, okay, let's let's just not go in that direction. No, Morgan, don't go anywhere. <laughs> you you went to the bad lighting spot. Oh my god, Morgan. Okay, whatever. Fine. Fine. Let's just get that photo. I mean, we could get it some other day when you're not like outside during like nights. It's not even night. It's just not really bright outside. Oh, oh my god, because of her hair, she's like not even visible. That's so silly. Oh my gosh, this is such a cute photo. It's just too dark. Okay, fine. Let's go inside. The bar is not that full. Um, okay, you need to go here together. The bar is not that full, so I guess they could do that. Like, take that photo inside. And do we have anywhere, anyone here that's like making things awkward? I don't really see anyone. Um, like Jay or Makoa. I feel like Makoa could be here. But he's not, luckily. Anyway, let's try that again with the photo. Take a selfie with... There we go. With Morgan. And hopefully it's going to be a cute one. And I really hope that no one's going to be in frame for this. That's why I didn't really want to go inside for the photo. Oh my god, don't sit down. Just, just take the photo. Why are you making this so complicated? Okay, they're being cute. Oh, I love them. Oh, I love them. They're so cute. Okay, let's try to get some kind of like cute, nice photo. I want to get the pose that they had on that one when I tried the first time. I think that's in like the relaxed ones. Um. Oh, is Makoa here? I didn't see him. Oh, I think it was this one. Okay, that's really cute. Okay, we'll just get a couple of those. Hopefully at least one will be good quality. So we can keep that. No matter what happens between these two in the future, at least we'll have that photo. But let me just check if we have at least one that's good quality. Um, poor, poor, poor. Oh, we don't have any that's actually good quality. Oh, we need to hurry up before like they move because this is a perfect spot. Oh, Akira might be in shot. <laughs> um, where are you going? Don't go outside. No. What? No. Okay. Sorry. I'll just I'll just be annoying with this because I really want them to take this photo. And Akira is gonna be in the shot. Oh my god. Okay. Fine. It was like perfect the first time it just didn't work out and we, we're staying here for like so long already and we haven't done any date activities i don't want morgan to hate me but i really want this photo oh my gosh akira is just gonna be right there <gasps> no <laughs> no akira okay maybe when i pose them he's not gonna be visible but that's Oh my god. Guys. What do I do? <laughs> That's just so stupid. I'm so upset. Fine. You know what? You know what? Fine. But at some point, when the wheel says that we have to kill someone, we know who is gonna be. You know what? We know who is gonna be. We have photo proof as well. Um, okay, let's just see if that's- that's fine. Of course this one's actually good quality. Of course this one's working. Okay, fine. We have a photo. <laughs> we have a photo. And we also have a future enemy. I'm not gonna bother with him right now, because we never know. We might need him at some point. Oh, you know what? He's feeling flirty. Okay, I'm not- I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. We're here with Morgan. We want to be spending time with Morgan. But you did say that Makoa is somewhere around here. So, like, where is he? Oh, our new friend is here. But, I mean, it's quite believable that Makoa is here. Because I feel like... Oh, Jay just left the house. Okay, that's good. But, yeah, Makoa could be here. Because he's here probably quite a lot. I don't see him, though. So, that's good. But where's Morgan? There you are. Um, let's try to have a good time on our dates and just be like nice and friendly and flirty. Get Akira out of the conversation. Oh my god, he wants to be involved so bad. Um, photobomb. That was just so. That was just so bad. Yeah, it was. I I'm still so upset about it, really. But okay, whatever. Let's try to have a nice time on this date. 
do a bit of flirting. Maybe I should get them a drink because it is happy hour. We might as well. We can still be cheap and actually we can just get sparkling water. Is that a bit too cheap? I feel like it might be because we're not like treating Morgan with that much respect. So maybe we should try. There, we can get something that's like actually a legit drink and it's just quite cheap as well. So they're, oh no, things are awkward because people are in the date. So Morgan's feeling a little bit uncomfortable. It's tedious. Ah, uh, it's such a full bar as well. It's so hard to have like a proper date here. Maybe we should just go sit somewhere like outside. We have like some seats here. Hmm. Okay, it kind of cleared up around us. So we could just do a little chat. Akira, stop. Akira, why? Why? Literally, why? We don't even know you. Are you obsessed with Morgan or something? Oh, the way that they're looking at each other is... Oh my gosh. Find yourself someone who's like looking at you the way Akira does at Morgan. What? An like, unexpected ship, honestly. <laughs> like, what? Okay. Um, are you just getting yelled at by someone? By Nelani, I think. Um, what a mess. Okay. Um... I think that we just introduced ourselves to Akira, if I'm not mistaken, yeah. Well, they actually like each other. They have amazing compatibility. Oh, but they don't like each other. All right, you think that Akira is pretentious and he thinks that Nelani is unreliable. Okay, that's kind of like, yep, kind of checks out. Oh, you're already married. Wow, this save. Well, to be fair, it has been like about a week. So I guess that you had time to be married, but you know. Things are moving quickly. We're not even focusing on Morgan. That's so unfortunate. Oh, we have our drink. So you know what? We could actually just go and like sit somewhere outside because this date is really not going that well. And I feel like Morgan will resent us for that. So I'm getting like a low. Yeah, look, it's not going that well. Let's try to sit here. Oh. Makoa. Makoa. Yep, you're here. Um... Okay. Oh, and it's ladies' night now, but okay, let's try to focus on um, Morgan. Do like a little little flirt, little romance, whatever. Literally just like something. Oh, well, I guess this is goodbye. Um, Don't call me ever. Oh my god. Well, you invited me here. That's not my fault. Morgan invited us here. Oh, I hate that so much. Uh, okay, fine. Let's just go home. I'm, I'm really disappointed with this. And hopefully Gidra is going to be there. I really hope so. Otherwise, I don't know what to do at this point. It's just so difficult to find any sort of partner for Nelani, honestly. That's why I really need to like hurry up and add your sims because at least we'll have like some more options. Because right now I am struggling. But okay. Let's just try to, like, relax for a bit. She doesn't even really need to be doing, like, that much. Um, she's feeling fine. I just need to, like, wait it out and hope that the Ghidri pop-up will, you know, pop up. <laughs> what are the animals doing? Jay, how are you doing? You're just sleeping on the couch. The goat is doing quite- oh no, you're really, really unhappy. I was just gonna say you're doing quite well. Okay, let's feed you. Um, and I'm just kind of hoping that we have some activity happening. And if not, seriously, I will try to go look for someone else because I'm over it at this point. I've never waited for Gidri for this long, I swear. Oh, she's feeling bored from the date. Oh, Gidri. Okay. Okay. Hi, Gidri. Hi, Gidri. Of course, of course you spawn in the bathroom. What's with people and toilets in this series? <laughs> like, what? Um. Well, at least we can actually just go and, like, jump into flirting. Oh, and she's feeling... She's feeling bored. Okay, I'm mad about that because it's not going to be a good conversation. But, okay, she's feeding the goats. And then we can just go and flirt with him. And it's going to be easy. It's going to be super easy. He's like a house boyfriend. Because he never leaves the lot. And we can just keep him secret. Like super easily. <laughs> He's literally just like a little pet. That she... Oh. 
Oh, scratch that. Scratch that. I was going to say something that like would not come out well. No. <laughs> nah. <laughs> no. Um, anyway, let's ask about being dead and um, try to <laughs> try to um, make him feel all good and everything. Um, try to romance him. It's going to be easy to have this affair with him because like, how's anyone going to find out ever? Unless we have um, Jay or Morgan if we at this point see Morgan ever again. Um, unless they come over to like stay the night and Ghidri happens to be wandering around. I don't think that anyone's gonna find out, so that's really good. Oh, how did she know all of his traits already? Do you have like the observance trait or something? Did I give you that at some point? Why would I? I don't see it, so that's interesting. He's just an open book, I guess. Um, so that's just real convenience. Okay, so we can just like express some passion for romance oh she's feeling kind of terrified right now um hopefully that's gonna be causing issues but right now she's still doing okay so we can just do like a bit of complimenting and everything so we can just properly like romance him up i guess i'm gonna be counting this as an affair once they actually officially woohoo i suppose I, I don't know what would be like at what point does it count as an affair i guess i guess when they woohoo i mean it depends on how you see it personally of course that i definitely see it as like they started flirting this is an affair already but <laughs> basically uh it's not that simple but you know what i mean it's like um but sorry i'm confused what are they doing oh you're giving him a massage what kind of massage? Hand massage. Interesting. I wish they could chat while they do this. Can they? Maybe they can actually. But yeah, I was gonna say that like at this point they are kind of having an affair. It is like it has that intent. Uh, but I'll just count it for the sake of the game. After they woohoo, it's gonna be an official affair. So right now we are romancing him, romancing him to like get to the woohoo stage and then we are like officially checking that off the list. Okay, you know what? Stop this massage because it's just annoying and it's not even building up their like little friendship or anything. No, stop doing that. That's so frustrating. Um... So, um, do a little bit of, I'm a bit, okay, I can definitely queue things up now. I was going to say I'm a bit unsure to queue things up because it will get cancelled if she continues the massage. Okay, anyway, let's try to work, work on woohooing with Ghidri, which shouldn't be difficult, I don't think. As long as she stays, like, normal, because she definitely has her moments where she <laughs> where she freaks out whatever happened with Makoa I don't want it to happen with Ghidri so we just need to be kind of careful but once they were who were good if they can I mean one of my sims had a baby with Ghidri and that happened well by accident but they definitely can woohoo oh no it's a boring conversation um all right, I guess I'm just like pushing it a bit too far. So maybe I should like do a bit of like funny, funny stuff. Yeah, gossiping. What do you like, Gidri? Do you like gossiping? I think that you... Oh, first kiss. Okay, hopefully he's gonna like that. So we can do that. We can see the little bar where we went with Morgan. See, it's just so close. Maybe Morgan's still there, but they just disappointed us so bad. I mean, it wasn't necessarily Morgan's fault, but... Oh. Oh my god. Wait. Awkward after a bad date. Oh, it was excruciatingly bad. I mean, that was because of Akira. But wait. See, their romance went down so much. I think. I think. Yeah, it was full. Oh, that's like so bad. I, I'm actually like kind of heartbroken. Oh my god. I didn't know that would happen. Anyway, these two are having their first kiss, so I guess that she's over Morgan. So we have another little occult romance going on. <laughs> um, we can do a bit of confessing the attraction. Hopefully that's gonna go kind of well. Do a bit of flirting. Uh, ask to be boyfriend? Absolutely not. But I need to throw in some more like friendly things so things don't get boring again. Um, just to be, like, completely sure that it goes, oh no, something happened. 
she's being awkward it's boring again oh, maybe maybe we need to be like doing a bit of like little funny things do you like do you like funny things Gidri? oh she keeps feeling inspired hopefully you'll be like inspiring this conversation to go to go forward somewhere please is this gonna be like more difficult than it should be because i just really don't have the patience they would rather go look at the magazine than talk. Oh my god, okay, that's bad. Save game. Good reminder, but I'm not gonna right now. Um, wait, I need to pause and actually queue up conversations. Um, just to be sure that it's, you know, happening. So let's try to, maybe a bit of mischief. I don't know if he would like that, but we could try. Just do a bit of silliness and hopefully that's gonna be helping. It's just so hard to get on with people. I don't know why. I don't know what's happening with Nelani, but she's just one of my most difficult sims. Like, right after Aspen, honestly. And Aspen was not that difficult. She would, like, get on with people who were kind of like her. But Nelani is such a weird case because I can't really, like, find people who I can't even see that they're, like, compatible with her. I can't even imagine the type of person that she's actually supposed to be compatible with. But hopefully this is gonna lead to somewhere. Okay, he's liking that so far. So we could... Oh, we can actually... Okay, we can actually woohoo. So let's woohoo into Hot Springs. Um, It is right in front of the house. So I can just gonna hope that Morgan's not like coming back from the bar and like walking past and seeing that. But I feel like we're kind of good. So we officially actually checked off everything that we need to be doing for today so i could actually spin some more but right after i make sure that they're actually going to do this are they are they not oh did you just cancel it on me it is like crossed out oh and now they can't do that wait um wait a minute <laughs> um I'm getting a little concerned. They can work on the shower. I kind of want it to be hot springs though. That's kind of fun, isn't it? All right, let's try that again. Maybe they can't do it because they can't like reach it or something. Maybe it's just like not facing the right way. It should though. Hmm. Okay, let's try that again. Maybe she got distracted because of the specters. But let me try that again. Okay, so... You're just doing a bit of funniness. Oh, it got it got cancelled again. Um, maybe it's just not working with the hot springs. Let's try a different location. Maybe just maybe if I just pick like a generic woohoo. Oh hi, welcome back. You just made it in time to see <laughs> to see these two woohoo. So I guess good timing. Um, <laughs> uh, but it's just not really working. Oh, it cancelled again. That's weird. Oh, maybe he has like preference for like um we can't woohoo gidri maybe if i just get rid of it i can't get rid of it um hold on let me think uh because i really want it to be gidri i mean it doesn't have to be woohooing but i i just see it that way where it makes sense that way oh um I want to change his preferences, but I don't know if I can do that. I actually saw, I think, a friend's tweet about it um, the other day asking if this can be changed for Gidri specifically, and I think that most people said no, um, so I'm kind of screwed here, but maybe I could try to uh, trait remove. Okay, that doesn't do anything. Um... I mean, yeah, true, true, ace rep, yeah, but not for this, not for this case. I really, I really need to woohoo bit Gidri. Sounds like I'm just so down bad, but I am in this case. We really just need to be, like, figuring this out. It doesn't have to be woohoo. It's already an affair at this point, but I would just like to, like, solidify that with a woohoo, you know? It's just... Um, how do they have him woohoo with Ginevra? I think that it's um, different per se. I think that maybe, or maybe I figured it out. I actually can't remember. Um, I either figured it out 
or it generates different preferences in different save files. But it could be that it's actually um, something that I changed. I could try to go into CAS with him and just change it in CAS, but I don't think it's going to let me. Let me just take a little look. But maybe I did have this issue with Ginevra and I fixed it, but I can't remember how. So, oh, I actually can't change it. Okay, okay. I thought that this was like locked. Okay, problem solved. Um, well, sorry to be changing your preferences, Ghidri, but you know what? I kind of see you as a bit of a bit of a woohoo anyone sort of guy, so <laughs> I feel like it kind of makes sense. Oh, okay. How do I spell his name? I think that that's how you spell his name, right? Um, I'm just gonna be calling him, call him and like, ghost? Ghidri ghost, because <laughs> I need to give him a name. Um, I think that that's how you spell his name. I completely forgot. I think that's good. Um, yeah, I guess that that's, that's just how I changed it for Ginevra. I really thought that, um, that section of it was locked, so I was just panicking there for no reason. <laughs> So, we can do a bit of flirting, just to make sure that things are okay. And now, now we can try to do woohoo in the hot springs. Oh, you're feeling a bit hungry, okay, doesn't matter. He's still taking the flirts, although it did say that he's not, like, interested in romance with anyone, so I'm not really sure what does that mean in this case. Still woohoo no one. Huh, weird. Did I change the wrong thing? <laughs> Did I actually do that? I think it should be okay. Is it not? Is it still not working? Really? Um, let's just try one more time. And, um... If necessary, I'll go back into cast and change things a bit further. If not, I'll leave it. But it should work. Okay, I think it might be working this time. It's just not working for the hot springs, I think. Okay, I think they're I think they're on the way. It's just really annoying that it's not in the hot springs, but okay, whatever. Okay, at least they're going and we actually did check off that final thing on the list for today. So once they are finished, I think I will maybe spin for just one thing because i feel like playing some more um so we can just like do a little bit more so okay they're doing their little woohoo so you just have fun there um, i'm just gonna speed it up a little bit because not much to do while they're doing that <laughs> um i'm not worried because she can't get pregnant from this because it happened in my save not so human because of some mod <laughs> issues, it was genuinely a mistake. So I'm not too worried about this. She genuinely cannot get pregnant with Ghidri. Um, Ginevra's case was really different. I mean, I could check, but I know that she's not. Uh, just for the fun of it. And then after that, we can go and spin the wheel one more time. So you just take that preg- Oh, that charged me! But it was a free one! That's not fair. Okay, I'll just take that punishment, sure. And obviously she's not pregnant, so okay, whatever. But that just cost me money. Honestly, I'm just I'm just gonna be adding that right back to me because that was just so unfair. <laughs> I just did that pregnancy test for like no reason as well. So like that was just so messed up. Um, so all right, you know what? Let's maybe go to the wheel again and spin what are we thinking maybe just once i mean i'll spin once and then we'll see if it's something like super super easy i'll spin one more time to just get like one more thing but if it's something like a little bit more complex i'll try to adopt a horse i don't have i don't have room for a horse i don't have room for a horse where am i gonna put a horse Guys, where am I going to put a horse? That's awful. That's 
where I'm gonna put that horse. I don't think I can even afford a horse right now. Maybe I can actually, just barely. But, um, okay, um, adopt. I, ca I can't actually rescue a horse, okay. Um, let me just have a little think. All right, um, what can we sell around here? Oh, we have these pictures, right? I can sell the ones that are like duplicate duplicates and I can, um, Put the picture that's good somewhere in her room. Although that's maybe going to be like a sour reminder of things because it didn't really turn out well in the end because Morgan hates us now. Kind of. But at least it's kind of nice. Oh, Ghidri's going to be seeing that. Sorry, Ghidri. But we can not get a horse quite yet because I need to get to 250. Um... Of replacing the hot springs. Do you think that's worth it? I don't think it is, especially because I wouldn't get enough money to actually properly replace it. It doesn't really matter, to be honest. At least they managed to woohoo. Um, but I need to figure out how to earn some more cash. Oh, you're sleeping. Okay, fine. At least that's speeding things up a little bit. Where is the goat? There you are. Okay, I can milk you for some simoleons. Are you feeling hungry? You're feeling okay. And I can do a bit of socializing, so you're happy. And, oh, we need to socialize with Jay. We haven't actually, like, been hanging out with Jay ever since we got him. So that's a little messed up on my part. So we can do, like, a little bit of, like, getting to know you and playing and petting a little bit. But now we can actually get a horse. Why are you freaking out? Oh, because of this. All right. Fair enough. Good luck. Bye. As soon as I see that, Gage, really? You're not going to be helping me with, like, the haunted little bits? That's so mean of him. Oh, he's still sleeping in the bed. <laughs> all right, fair enough. I didn't even think that he would need to sleep because he's a ghost, but all right, sure. Um. Anyway, Peach, you need some attention as well as Jay there. So, while she's doing that, I'm going to queue up actually rescuing a horse. There we go. It's going to be a huge mistake, though. Because I don't have anywhere to put this horse. It's going to be so bad, because, like, I can't even build a stable or anything. And I don't think they can go up the stairs. I actually don't know. But I don't think that they can. So even if I wanted to, like, get rid of this and build a stable, I, I don't think that I can. So the horse will just have to live outside. And, like, good luck. But which one are we thinking? Oh my god, most of them have wings. I have to get rid of that because like all of the horses have wings in my game. <laughs> I hate that so much. That's just so awful. Um, but which one are we thinking? And also, name ideas, please get on that because I'm just not smart for that. Um, I kind of like Zig. It's He's also like matching the house. I, cl I like Clover as well. I kind of don't really want to get like a little one because they require more care. So I just can't be bothered. So if you're going to be getting one, it's not going to be Boomer. Um, if we're going to be getting one, we have to get one because <laughs> the wheel said so. Um, but I'm thinking Clover. Clover looks weirdly like human. Oh, you're an elder horse. I feel bad because, like, you will not have an easy existence here. You're just left to the elements. I really feel bad giving you is like a last stage of your life to be just like that, but it is what it is. Kind of like Zig. Oh, you're an elder horse as well. Are they all elders? Okay, they're not. But, okay, you like Clover. I think I like Clover as well. Um, He looks so, like, wise. I don't know, there's something like superhuman about him, which is not something that you would really want to say about a horse, but I feel like I feel like I like Clover, so let's go with Clover. You can get more of them. Oh my god, no, just one. Um, do you actually go and pick up the horse, yeah? Okay, you actually go physically pick up the horse. And we won't be able to feed the horse because um I won't be able to buy the thing that they need. Um, like the hay thing and the water thing, so that's gonna suck. We'll have to work on that for a bit. So, okay, you just get that poor horse and 
Do you have any name ideas? Because I definitely don't. Um, it would be a really weird theme to just name them after her partners, but I'm kind of thinking Morgan. Because, like, Morgan, please come back. <laughs> um, how long can I make this um, name? Sorry. Morgan? <laughs> I'm sorry, that date was just bad. Sorry. Is that- that's like so stupid. Yeah. Yep. Sorry, Morgan. Um... You know what? I'm just gonna tell you a joke and that'll be your name. So like... Oh, I feel so bad for this horse. It'll just spend like its remaining days just wandering around the house that they can't even get into with this stupid, stupid name. And stupid, stupid wings. I'll get rid of those, but not for now, because I just don't want to. I don't want to deal with that right now. Um, you just want to go hide in bed, hide from your problems that you just caused to this poor creature. Um, all right, fair enough. But I do need to see, because like, see, my law boundary is just ridiculously small. Everything is full. I don't even know where I'll be able to fit the hay for the horse. So that's kind of what I'm worried about. Um, so that's really not good. Um, but let me see how much it costs. Ooh, I could actually just get like a bit of prairie grass. And once that grows, the horse can just eat for free. I feel like that's kind of good. I just see, I don't have anywhere to put it. That's the problem. Because if I want to put it here on the like corner, it just built like brings it up here. Um, I mean, I could get rid of the hedges, but I feel like I'll still have that same problem. So, yeah, I don't know. I'm kind of screwed. Well, this horse is at least. Oh, I could actually, um, get rid of some of these and that would give me some money back. Oh, and the flower bunny left some little things there. Okay, I can definitely put some like little hay there. Oh, and these are like not too expensive, but I will have to like uh, pay to fill them, which is not really that good. Prairie grass grows all the time. I feel like just getting these two would be good enough. So we'll just get a bit of that, and I should probably give you some water. Probably, I don't know. Let's just get you that, and that'll be kind of it that this poor horse gets. <laughs> um, let's just change it like that so it matches the house a little better. So that's the entire horse area. Oh, I kind of need to get you this stupid ball, right? Oh my god, where am I going to put that? That's just not going to work. There is no way that that's actually going to work. I could try, but I don't think that that's going to be functional. Um, well, I can make it like nice and colorful, like clown core, but I don't think that the horse can use it. But I mean, we could try actually, because I can ask you to play. So is that going to work? If not... Oh, it's actually working, is it? Oh. Okay, well, then you're fully sorted. It's just going to suck when it rains, but I guess that you're okay. So we have that sorted. Um, Yidri's here. Hi. Okay, please don't be causing me issues because our affair needs to stay secret. So like, please, like, don't be roaming around the house when we have guests over. Are you coming over to see Sor Sorry Morgan? <laughs> Okay, um, sorry Morgan, why, why did you let me do that? Why did you, why did you let me do that? <laughs> okay, um, how are we feeling about maybe spinning one more time? Because I feel like doing more, um, because this didn't really take that long. So I'm just going to be like trying one more time just to see what's going to happen. So I'm kind of fully ready to go one more time just spin for the final time whatever this is it's gonna be last because we have been doing this for like two hours already so i feel like it is reasonable to quit <laughs> um but let's just see what it is max a skill okay 
<laughs> okay. Okay. Um, maxing a skill. Not super quick and easy, is it? Um, well, we do actually have a couple of skills that are um, to level five. <laughs> sorry, Morgan. Yep. Sure is. I mean, look, sorry, Morgan's having like a lot of fun. So like, I feel like it's okay. I'm not too upset. Sorry, Morgan's having a good time. So despite all the unfortunate events in his poor life, he's having a good time. He's loving his ball. He's loving, he's he's having like full access to Sulani just roaming around. That's like honestly pretty fun, pretty nice. It's, as, again, it's just gonna suck when it rains eventually because I don't really have anywhere to put him, but he's having a good time. But anyway, I need to max a skill. <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't think that I'll be able to do that just now, like in one go, but who are you? What are you doing here? What are you? No. Um... Anyway, um, we could try to do dancing. Um, we could try to do the little occult thing, but that would mean that I have to buy a table and I don't have money for that. So that's not really an option. Um, pet training? Okay, I can't do that on a cat, of course. Um, so dancing it is. Ooh, this reminded me. I could join a club and, um, well, the wheel didn't say that, but I could still try to apply for an invite. Um, yeah, this is a dancing club, so I feel like maybe that could be helping me to, like, gain skill from that, so, sure, let's try to go. <laughs> I don't even know where the gathering is for this, so hopefully it's a nightclub. Well, isn't it like 11 a.m. or something? Maybe not the best time to go clubbing, but I don't know. I don't think I'll really sit through like actually maxing the entire skill now, but at least let's get started and then we'll finish it in the last, in the next stream. Um, but let me just see. Oh, she's not like officially, officially in the club. Okay, that's annoying. Who's the leader? You are. Okay, I need to do like an introduction on you. Um, I hope that she at least has some dancing skill. And um, are there any other ones? Oh my god. Okay, you just do your scanning. Just do your little thing. Um... And I'll focus on my thing. Um, okay, I can apply to the club. I, I'm doing that right now though, aren't I? So what's with the double application thing? Please just let me into the club and then I just kind of have to hope that they also have that skill boost. I feel like that's a trait that you actually have to... Did you say no to her for the club? It's an exclusive club, and you don't make the... I didn't even know that they could refuse you. I thought that this was, like, just, like, a thing that they do. Where they, like, invite you, but, of course, that you get in. I had no idea that you actually can't get refused. That's crazy. Well, while, while we're at the nightclub, at, like, noon, we might as well dance, right? So, sure. Uh, you can't get to the bathroom. Oh my god, okay. Um, oh, she's gonna pee herself in the middle of this club. That's so embarrassing. <laughs> Can you not get in? Why? Is that- Oh, okay, that's not the bathroom that you're supposed to go in. Where is it then? That's just so dumb. Where's the other bathroom? Oh my god. I don't want her to pee herself. It's all the way upstairs. Oh my god, you better make it there. I can't believe that she got refused out of that club. I guess that because she like didn't make friends with people first, but that's just so stupid. That's just, that's ridiculous, honestly. But you know what? You just make yourself feel a little better. Oh, she's tired. I was gonna say, if she maybe like, um, 
mm, practice a speech or which one is it where you can actually like make yourself feel oh this one i think boost confidence if she makes herself confident maybe she'll gain um dance skill a bit faster and while she's doing that let me just check where she's at oh she could do photography as well to be fair that's also i think level five skill let me just take a little look yeah it is level five um but she's kind of there in dancing so i guess i'll just go with dancing is there anything else that's up to level five no um I mean, the medium scale will make skill would make sense because of Ghidri, but again, I don't want to be buying that table because we just don't have the money. So we'll just try to dance this day away and just hope for the best that it just happens kind of quickly. And I think that I probably will. I mean, I could do like a bit of, um, not really cheating, but just like a little skill boost, hopefully. Um, shit, sorry. <laughs> just, just punched my microphone, sorry. I really hope that that didn't sound awful. I forgot it was there, sorry. Um, anyway, what I wanted to do was add some uh, traits there, um, to hopefully give her a bit of a boost. So, party place. Okay, that's not really helping with the, like, scales and stuff. Is there anything that actually does that? I don't think so. Um, maybe this one, but that's like charisma and comedy and stuff. Eh, I'll just leave it. It doesn't really matter. So you just do your dancing and whatnot. So hopefully that's going to do like something. She's just so tired though. I don't think it's really going to go well. An emotional roller coaster for sure. That's definitely how her life's going. Wait, where is she? Oh, she's just at the back. Okay, she's still dancing though. And she just reached level two. Again, I don't think I'll really sit through this. I don't want to make you sit through this in one go. It's a little ridiculous, but at least we just get like a bit of a head start and then we can finish it at the beginning of the next stream, I think. Actually, I don't know what the next stream is going to be. I will be streaming again on Sunday on like our usual slot, but I actually don't know what it's going to be because I feel like it's a bit of an overkill to stream this Let's Play. Oh my gosh, Makoa. Makoa, what are you doing here? All right, whatever. But I feel like it's a bit of an overkill to stream that s this series again two times this week. So maybe the next stream is going to be like a bit of a like cast stream oh maybe i could do like makeovers of your sims live that'd be kind of fun i feel like maybe i could do that maybe we can do a bit of that i still haven't decided but i feel like that's maybe a pretty good decision <laughs> um a really good idea so i think i might actually do that um but okay we'll talk about that on community posts as usual but right now let me just see okay you are really tired but let's just go have you like dance um for just a bit so I just see where dancing skill is at. Um, so she's like a third through her level two. Not that much. Oh, what do we say? I know what these options are, but like, what do we say? Do we want free money or, or do we want to have the pressure of getting married? I'm going to let you decide because this... Okay. Um... Okay, you, you're loving the idea of uh, doing makeovers live. Okay, I like that as well. It's just keep in mind that um, I might not be able to do like a lot of them live. I'll do a lot of them off camera as much as I can. But live, I mean, I could do quite a lot. It's just not going to be like all outfits live. And then I can like do outfits in my own time. Because it, it usually takes me like a really long time to um, do makeovers of your sims. Because I do all outfits because I want them to be like properly like ready for the let's plays um but that's usually like so time consuming but in the live stream i guess i'm just gonna do the first outfit and then the rest in my own time so yeah sure i actually really like that and you want the pressure of getting married okay all right i knew i knew you would do that i just knew it um all right let's just get the money uh, but we have to get married in seven days um, it's probably gonna be quicker though, because the way that they do this is like, 
this tense mood is running down and for example if she did like yoga or whatever activity would help to get the tense mood down this also goes down quicker <laughs> so i guess for the sake of the money we have to hope that she just stays tense like this so that's definitely gonna be an obstacle to think about i mean she does actually still oh not makoa she actually does still have this like actual boyfriends although they're not having a good relationship at all um she could technically get married oh i don't think he would like this yeah i think that she's non-committal as well so i don't think that they would really like the idea of getting married um and their relationship sucks as as it is hmm you know what i want to experiment let's go home and i'm thinking i'm gonna let her sleep for a couple of minutes because she's super tired and we'll just set things up for the next stream a little bit uh well for the next episode at least um so okay we're already on track let's just drag jay with us to the house but we're already on track for the dancing skill i'll just have to like note that somewhere so i don't forget that we're doing dancing um but we also need to be like figuring out if we want to like marry jay <laughs> i don't think that marrying jay is gonna be like easy um oh he will probably refuse a proposal right um yeah but i want to see if that would work but we have to improve our relationship massively um so that's not gonna be easy but let's try to do like apologizing i feel like that should be okay and maybe oh oh my god look at that their friendship is just crazy oh but she's he's flirting she doesn't want that but you should though oh he's embarrassed it's awkward okay um oh i said i would let her sleep i forgot right that would make things a little bit easier yeah true true once she feels a little bit better i feel like it's gonna be a bit easier so oh she passed out <laughs> okay fine fine i'm just gonna have her like go sleep for like a little while and then if jay is still in the house which it looks like he's quite comfortable in here um we'll try to see if we can get to the point where we can get married <laughs> i don't think that we'll be able to do that just now but at least to get engaged and then we can do i mean realistically they will just elope immediately it's not like it's gonna be a real wedding but still oh the time is moving slowly most likely because jay is here do you want to oh and gage is here now as well oh, this is so annoying actually can we marry gidri hold on a minute um i mean oh no <laughs> they're chatting gidri be careful what you're saying to him okay you know what jay let's just have you like be sent home and i know that we can um ask him to be boyfriends there we can do that immediately jay left so we're good so we can actually marry Gidri. We could get that done, like, immediately. That's actually- Oh my god, Jay. <laughs> Jay is fighting Gidri. The wrong Jay. Are you- Are you defending your person who you're named after? All right, sure. Interesting. I didn't think that you'd be on Jay's side. Are you feeling a little guilty? You should. But, okay. She's asking- Oh. He said no. Oh, and she wants to be loyal. <laughs> no, <laughs> no. <laughs> She's the least loyal sim I've ever had. No. But this is like really embarrassing. Um, why did he say no? Are sims like less likely to say yes to a sim who's non-committal? Because he's he's not non-committal. So I'm kind of confused. Oh, is that because he has preferences for like no romance? I might have to change that then. 
Like, sorry to be completely changing Idris' preferences, I usually wouldn't, but it, it just kind of worked out too perfectly, so I just kind of want to keep Idris around. Um, but, oh no, he actually is romantically attracted to women, so it should work. Um, okay. I guess, like, he just said no because she's not committal. Or maybe they need to build up their friendship a little bit more. I'll try to work on that, just to have Gidri as, like, an official boyfriend. I kind of want to try to get to that point today, and then we're good, and we have foundation set for the next time. In what universe is she loyal, exactly? <laughs> um, so, yeah, I hate it when the game just does stuff like that. It just makes zero sense. Um, but let's try to make things a little bit less awkward, because this is just ridiculous. Discuss this embarrassing mood, like, this is just so bad. Oh, she's so stinky. I think that we need to take care of that, because that's just, like, not- not really appealing, is it? Um, I need to make him feel a little bit better, because he's just feeling so embarrassed. I don't really like that. Wait, what are you doing? What are you doing? Where are you going? Are they going to- I don't think that they're going to Wuhu. I mean, they might as well, but I don't think that they are. What's happening? Are they just going- Oh, are you giving him another massage? That's annoying. I don't really want to do that. Alright. Doing like a little foot massage and a foot that's just not even there. I mean- What? She just broke up with Jay. Literally? How? Does does anyone know how that happened? <laughs> does anyone know how that happened? I've never seen that before. Where it's just... Is it like a social bunny thing? Nailani, I'm about to blick block you into next year. Begone, peasant. Okay, Jay. I guess that that's why she she broke up with him. <laughs> what? I'm so confused. That's so weird. I mean, I guess that we're not even having an affair anymore because she's not dating anyone exclusively because we're not exclusive with um, Morgan. I mean, so we still technically did have an affair, but not anymore, because um, no relationships. <laughs> so I guess the Gidri is going to be our next victim now, because I feel like she will have to cheat eventually. At this point, it's like it's in her DNA, but I don't know how that happened. That's so weird. But Gidri, try to stop feeling so embarrassed and... Uh, Come here, flirt with me, try to feel a little better, and get in a relationship with me, please. Um, okay, I'm not gonna jump into that immediately, of course, um, but I need to make him maybe, maybe tell him a funny story, would that make him feel better? She's feeling so tense as well, that's just really not the best setting to be asking to go into a relationship. Maybe just do like a bit of gossiping. You can tell him that you broke up with your boyfriend, I guess, over text or something. I don't know. I, I genuinely can't find proof of it, so it's just really weird, but I guess I'll take it. She wants to kiss someone. We can try that with Gidri, it's just they're not really feeling up for it. We could try, though, just like a little kiss. Maybe it's gonna go okay. I'm noticing that their friendship- Okay, it's just going up now, as soon as I said that. I was gonna say that their friendship is just not going up. But it's going up, but a little slow. But, um, maybe we'll get to a point where they can actually be dating. Well, I don't know if we can actually marry him. That's kind of the problem. I've never really gotten to that point in my not-so-human um, they're not even dating, but if the option to ask to be boyfriend is there, I'm sure that there's also an option to ask to, like, propose and get married. So I feel like we should be okay. Maybe I should, like, double check, but 
it's it's whatever. If it fails with Gijui, we can easily switch to someone else. I don't really know who. We don't really have any candidates. <laughs> um, but right now, let's try to make things work with Gijui. He's still embarrassed. He does look flirty. Maybe this is just like bugged or something because it doesn't look like he's embarrassed and he's definitely not acting oh why do you have vampire socials oh it's just uh, like a separate thing i thought that it was like socials that vampires can do <laughs> she's definitely not one but you never know maybe it's gonna happen in the future i feel like she'll be a really messy vampire um woohoo that's not really raising their like friendship Maybe I can try, because she's feeling confident now. Oh, maybe I could try to... Oh, he said yes! Okay, that's real good. Maybe we can even get married real quick now. Maybe that's a bit quick. But they did start dating. Maybe. Do I have an option? If I have an option to propose, I don't think I do. Okay, I don't think I do. I think that they need to have like more friendship. So we can get that done real quick. Kind of crazy that I'm speedrunning this as well, but it could happen. So, you know, we can have like a really successful stream. So I'm kind of, kind of set on it. <laughs> um, are we liking this um, direction? I didn't even ask if you agree, but I'm kind of just going to assume that you do. Uh, thanks to their compatible personalities, they're like having... A harmonious relationship. It's easier to be friendly or whatever. I'm not really seeing it. If anything, I'm kind of struggling. Oh, she needs to pee. Um, all right. Uh, I don't want her to like pee herself. So go pee. And while she's on her way, I see that Jay is scratching the little sofa thing. That's really annoying. Um, but while she's doing that, I'll just check. Hmm. Still no proposal. So I am like a little concerned. Maybe I should Google if I'm able to, like, do this, but it's fine. Okay, so you're liking- you're liking the direction. Okay. Um, well. Oh no, she didn't pee and she's just going upstairs to, like, take a bath. Oh no, girl, what are you doing? Oh, her needs are bad. I wasn't paying attention. Why are her needs like that? <laughs> I- I really wasn't paying any attention. But I need to hurry up. Why are you going upstairs to take a shower? Nilani, what? What are you doing? Okay, whatever. At least she's taking that shower. And, okay, I'm not going to bother with food and sleeping now. Because Gidri is still here. But I have a feeling. Um, I can just give him a key, maybe. Because, I mean, he's coming over any time anyway. But I'll, I'll give him a key. So maybe that's going to entice him to, like, be coming over more. <laughs> um... But I have a feeling that maybe we can't actually marry Ghidri, which um, should have thought about that <laughs> before I actually started going in that direction. But um, I'll try just a bit more. Maybe it's really just their friendship bar, but I don't think so. Because I'm pretty sure you can marry Sims with like much less friendship. Okay, this is just their romance, so I'm kind of focusing on the wrong thing there. Uh, okay, physical intimacy. I really don't think that we can actually do this. Okay, that's annoying. That's really frustrating. I wasted a lot of time on this. Oh, they, okay, they're just good friends now, so maybe it really was the friendship. No, it wasn't. Oh, it wasn't. That's annoying. Really? Really? I mean, that's good to know that you can't marry Ghidri, but that's a bit disappointing, isn't it? Hmm. Who's the next option then? We don't really have that many good ones. Oh, until I bring him back to life. Okay, that makes sense. Well, I'm definitely not going to bother with that then. That's way too much work. Um, so... 
Wait a minute. I need to check something. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. That's just that's just her body type. I got really scared because it looked like she had like a little bump, but it's not actually. Oh, that's that's just her like the way her body looks. Oh, that that really scared me. That does look like a bump, doesn't it? That um I can't have her take a pregnancy test. And I'm pretty sure that that's just how how her body looks, but I just want to check in MCC because I'm just a little paranoid now. Okay, no, she's not pregnant. Okay. Sorry. False alarm. We good. Um, the house is definitely not though. I'm just gonna be cleaning this poor creature and doing like a little feed of you and stuff. But we do have to get married. We still have seven days left, so the timer is not that quick. Um, and we'll also be dancing a lot in the next episode to max that skill. But I think that I'll just end here then, because there's no point trying to cram in more activities, because we're kind of currently stuck. So I'm just going to be thinking about who can we marry. I'm kind of thinking that... We might have to go back to Morgan. I didn't really want to hurt Morgan. But we're in a bit of a pinch. So maybe we do have to like go back to you and try to marry. I mean, I wouldn't be mad because like we like Morgan and getting married would be kind of nice. But um, things are quite awkward, aren't they? Um, but yeah, I, I'll just... And here having a nice little moment with Peach. Oh, let me just check how sorry Morgan's doing. You're not really too happy. Oh, your social's low and your hunger's low because you're out of grass. Oh, sorry about that, buddy. That that must be quite unfortunate. Yeah, I'll try to figure out a better setup for him as well. Whoops, sorry. Wrong screen. Pretend you didn't see that. <laughs> but I will just kind of end um, here. We actually streamed for like a lot longer than I thought. It's like over like two and a half hours. Oof, that's long. Um, so thank you for coming to the stream. Um, it's really nice to be back because well, I haven't streamed for like three weeks or something. Oh my god, I'm so like disheveled looking. That's just awful. I just like put on like anything before the stream because I wanted to stay warm so I wanted something with like long sleeves and then it's just so hot actually because of the light and everything so it's just such a mess <laughs> um just just saying because I'm because I see that this like looks so weird <laughs> um but yeah anyway I'm just gonna go now so thank you for coming to the stream I hope that you enjoyed this like little chaotic thing to be back and um what a timing with the eclipse and everything, right? As soon as I'm finally ready to come back to YouTube, the world just goes dark. <laughs> just my luck, right? Um, but yeah, thank you for coming to the stream. I hope that you had a lot of fun. So I'll see you on um, Sunday with makeovers of your Sims.